I woke up after sleeping on a park bench for about eight hours, drunk as a skunk, and I have a wrist drop, and my doctor told me I had Saturday night palsy. You know, probably almost 100 years ago, this was described as Saturday night palsy because there's a picture of a drunk on a park bench, and he was sort of laying on his arm. And the radial nerve wraps around the spinal groove and the humerus right here. And he fell asleep on his arm, and he had a complete wrist drop. And it was named Saturday night palsy. You see it from sleeping on your arm, you see it from trauma, like a broken arm, fractures of the humerus. Um, you can see it when they put the humerus back together when it's fractured, you can put a nail through it. Um, we also call it honeymoon, honey, honeymoon palsy because, you know, you never really slept with anybody that much and they're laying on your arm all night, which, you know, after you've been married about three days, people quit doing that. And parent treatment, you know, is with prednisone. We don't really know what to do, but we just don't like to wait. So we blast people with prednisone 40 to 60 milligrams a day and taper by 10 milligrams every other day till off. Use a wrist splint, physical therapy, a good vitamin cocktail, including L-methylfolate, 1800 micrograms a day. So that's Saturday Night Palsy. Um, this is Dr. Caldwell Miller, the brain doctor. Like, comment, subscribe. I actually answer every comment. So make some comments and I will answer them. More later.